Hello my friends, welcome again. Today I've just received a new uh, item on my on my house and this once again is a book. Let me get my Swiss Army knife to open it. And this one is a, a programming book and uh, this is not a new book for me. It's not it's not I've I've heard about it before, but uh, I've never had it physical in a physical printed version. And this one is uh, the C programming language by Brian Kerningham and Dennis Ritchie. As I was saying, uh, this is not a book that I have never heard before of it, uh, because I have been using it through all, throughout all my career as an engineer, and mostly. I've been using the C, the C programming language in uh, in embedded applications. But uh, uh, nowadays, I've been thinking more and more about uh, changing my path because I'm mostly a control systems engineer. But uh, I would like to learn a bit more about uh, programming and more in-depth applications. Uh, so uh, I think that. Uh, a printed version will be useful for me, though I have uh, the electronic. Ver I have bought previously the electronic version, and the and in my university we have access to physical editions. But uh, I think that this uh, will will be useful in my house in the in my house, and I I can access it. I can I can uh, check it every time that I have a. a, a question about uh, the language or the syntax, syntax and uh, anything like this. So uh, this is the book. Uh, let me read you the, the back, the, the part in the back. It says uh, the C programming language. This is the second edition and as you can see this uh, should be uh, C 2011. And it says we have tried to retain the brevity of the first edition uh, C is not a big language, and it uh, is not well served by a big book. We have improved the exposition of critical features such as pointers that are central to C programming. We have refined the treatment of a complicated declaration. Uh, we, we, ha we have refined the original examples, and we have added new examples in several chapters. For instance, the treatment of complicated declarations is augmented by programs that convert declaration into words and vice versa. As before, all examples have been tested directly from the test, uh, which is in machine readable form. And the author says that in the preface of the first edition, C wears uh, well as one. Experience with it grows. Uh, with a decade more experience, we still feel that way. We hope that this uh, book will help you to learn C and use it well. And yes, uh, I will use it as a manual or as a reference book. And let me guide you through the contents. I, I think that should be around over here. This is the index. Okay, the context. We have uh, the first chapter and this uh, tutorial introduction. As you can see, the the contents here. We get uh, getting started variables, four statements, symbolic constants, and so on. The second chapter, types and operators. It's also a basic uh, basic topic. And then we have a control flow. In this in this uh, chapter, we will learn uh, if else uh, and other control flow structures that will help us to to create programs that have certain logic. Okay, we have else if else if switch loops uh, while and for and do while and break and continue go to labels. And we have functions and programs in the fourth chapter. As you can see, the contents here. We can uh, we have an introduction to the C preprocessor, and in chapter five we have a pointer and array. And I must uh, say that this book has been recommended. Uh, well, it was recommended to me when I was studying because of this particular chapter. Okay, because uh, we need a, a good understanding of this uh, this particular topics of the, of these particular topics, and uh, uh, in in those in. In the past, I uh, I was I, I asked someone to to about these topics, and this is the book that they have recommended. Now, chapter six we have structures, and chapter seven we have uh, 
input and output, and this is a like a like a previous or a primitive example of what will become a object-oriented programming. Okay, so. Uh, Capture 8, we have the Unix system interface, and I must mention here that I'm interested also in the, in getting a printed version of the Unix uh, programming environment. That is another book by uh, Kerringham, and I don't remember right now the other author. And Capture 8 uh, is, as I mentioned, is the Unix systems, and uh, we have app Appendix A, and we, this, is, this should be a reference manual, and we can, uh, uh, if we have any any question about the the, the syntax, I mean, we can uh, go to this section. Also, we have the standard library. This will be very helpful. And in my case, since I'm trying to to expand my basic knowledge of C, uh, as I mentioned, I know a bit about it, but I, I want to give my full efforts to this uh, for uh, for some months in order to to improve my my abilities in this. Uh, in this uh, in this language, and perhaps improve my opportunities of getting a uh, a job, in particular in C, or perhaps I can I could then uh, uh, get deeper into another language. But I don't know yet. This these are only this will be in the future. Future, and we have a summary uh, of changes in this Appendix C. So uh, this is the unboxing of this uh, interesting book. I hope you. If you're thinking about buying it, I think this uh, will be, this could be helpful. This was not a cheap book in my country, at least. Uh, it was like uh, like seventy five dollars, I think. Yeah, something like that. And yes, uh, in 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 my country, that's not. Not a cheap book, but uh, it's it's not all it's not an incredibly expensive book all either. So uh, I, we can give it a try. And as I mentioned, this book is uh, is very useful and very recommended in Amazon or in any place that you will you can buy it. Okay, bye bye.